Hello, this is one of our English classrooms. Hopefully, as you can see, we've got a variety of displays that usually aid uh, the learning that's taking place in the classroom. So often in the classroom, we might have key quotes um, linked to the text we are studying, such as um, at GCC level, the students study a poetry anthology. So there'll be key quotes from the 15 poems that they study in the Power and Conflict anthology. Um, also in year eight, the students study nature and the romantics poetry and they also study a novel called Where, Where the World Ends. And when they study the poetry and the novel, they will be thinking about their academic analysis. So we often might have writing frames and keywords on our classroom displays that will help support the learning of our students. Our students also have knowledge organisers where they will have keywords and sentence stems and facts linked to their learning and that will help them become great learners. And we often display those in the classrooms and we use them when we're teaching. Here's another one of our English classrooms where we have got some key displays um, linked to our key stage four texts. For example, we have got J.B. Priestley's and Inspector Calls, and we've also got Dr. Jekyll and Mr. Hyde um, display here. Lots of our key terms that we teach our students in key vocabulary are displayed um, on the display boards and also some of the context. So for example, we've got socialism, capitalism, the class divide. When we teach our students about Edwardian society. Um, our students often really enjoy English here at Glynn because we're not only just um, reading stories and fiction, non-fiction, but we're thinking about the context that surrounds our text and how this has influenced our writers. Our students often engage in topical debates about the context that they have studied. For example, capitalism and socialism and classism and does it still exist today in modern society? This is one of our media studies classrooms where students study GCSE and and A-level media studies. In this classroom, they will focus on the theory and behind media studies. So they will look at the theoretical concepts and they will study media theory and theorists to understand why media texts are created in a certain way and how audiences might respond to them. Also, media studies is very practical, a very practical subject too. So the students will get to create film posters, magazines, and um, for example, on the, the wall here, we've got the Wall of Fame and these are some magazine um, covers and articles that our students have created. They also can create things like music videos, TV shows, adverts, film openings, where they'll learn um, how to edit and think about cinematography and camera angles on our computer facilities. And we use um, some of our media studies teachers who are actually specialists in the industry. Thank you very much for visiting our virtual tour and we look forward to seeing you in September.